Joining me, as always, is Jane Downs. Hi, Jane Downs. And joining me, as usual, is Jane Downs. Now, it ain't the Rovers' return, but they sure know how to make a good hot pot. I've come down to Gallagher's Boxy House here in Temple Bar to meet chef owner Pora Gallagher, who's going to help us recreate Betty's hot pot. So, tell us, what exactly is a hot pot? Hot pot is basically what well, Betty's hot pot's based Betty's on. Hot a, pot, yeah. It's based on a Lancashire hot pot. And it's okay, not great. unlike an Irish stew. Yep. Then we're going to add in our onion. Yep. Do you want me to pass it to you? Great, thank there you. There you go. A little bit of onion in there I'll as well. I'll be your assistant Nicely for the moment. Ah, great. Always like assistance. Mm, good. That's gorgeous. That is very good. Good seller. That, yeah. I feel like I'm in the Rovers return right now. Hi, as seen on TV, gang. I saw Joey from Friends on the Graham Norton show on 3E recently, where he was talking about his new show. It got me thinking, what are the rest of the cast doing now? I've seen Jennifer Aniston in lots of Hollywood chick flick movies, but the rest of the cast seem to have gone off the radar. So my question is, where are they now? Thanks, Shauna. Brian, I'm here in the Serview office. I, like the viewers at home, I'm a little bit confused. So I was hoping you'd take us through a little bit of information, starting with what exactly is Serview? Is there any other fees associated with Serview? You can bring me over now and show me how to do it, okay? Okay, great. <laughs> okay, so Brian, I've gone out and bought my uh, Serview ready set top box. Yeah. And this is my TV at home. What do I do? That sounds simple. I think even I could do it. I'm a 30 year old gal and to be honest, I've really been enjoying pretending to be a teenager again. I've been following One Direction's career with great interest. I can't help it, they're my guilty pleasure. But there's one thing that's been keeping me up all night, pardon the pun. After the whole furore over Niall Horan's eBay half-eaten toast auction, do we know who the person is who willingly played 100,000 Australian dollars for veggie my covered toast? And more importantly, why? I like them and all, but it's $100,000. Seriously. Thanks. Jesse Byrne, Waterford. I'm here with Colin in Back to the Future to techify my life. Colin, you're going to show me three hot gadgets for entertainment. Absolutely. And What's I'm, the first it's one? all based around TV technology. Okay, well, thank you very much, Colin. I know what I'm getting this year for Christmas. I've got a letter here from Mary who writes, Hi there. Good luck with the new show. I want to know why TV3 haven't put Gossip Girl back on our screens. I miss it and I want it back. Please bring it back. Going through withdrawals now. XOXO, Mary and McCroom. So it didn't stop us coming up with a few merchandising ideas of our own. What do you got there, Jane? Well, um, first of all, I think a range of clothing, Ooh, you know, wouldn't yeah, go yeah, astray. Yeah. Sparkly yeah. dresses, bright bags yeah. and cosmetics. To go, with the to go with the bag. To go with the bag. And then I like the way you, thought about that. you can't think about California without a bit of fake time.